Hi, I'm Lucy Ravitch from KidsMathTeacher.com, where we take everyday things and turn them into hands-on math activities. Yay! Today for Math Activity Thursday, we're going to be working with Wreck and Rex. Wreck and Rex are a great way to help your kids practice with the numbers 0 through 20. With the number and lines, you can actually move the beads over, count as you go. They can see the difference between the number 5 and the other numbers between 5 and 10. A Wreck and Wreck is great for all kindergartners, first graders, and second graders. It helps them understand the numbers between 0 and 20 and helps them with addition and subtraction. It's really easy to make one. The supplies you'll need for this activity are some foam sheets, pipe cleaners, and some beads. One of the first steps to making your Wreck and Wreck is to pick out your foam sheet and your pipe cleaner colors. You'll want to try to pick contrasting colors with the beads. Just make sure you can see your beads separate from your pipe cleaner and your backing. You'll want to group your beads into groups of five. You can either use four different colors, or two different colors, or even three different colors, as long as you group them in groups of five. Then when you put them on the pipe cleaner, you'll put them in groups of five. With your foam sheet, you'll want to make a rectangle and make certain dots. These lines across will be about five inches across. And when you put your pipe cleaner in, you'll put them through the dots and this will become the back. Poke your pipe cleaner through the pole and then start putting the beads on the pipe cleaner, five at a time. When clasping the back end of your pipe cleaner, lay them flat, gather them around one point and twist. After you get that, you can either twist them around the back ends or you can cut them off but I like to twist them around the back end. Once your Wreck and Wreck is finished, you can count with your kids. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Good job. So you can count to twenty? What's two plus five? They see it's five. Then count on six, seven. And just see the difference between the numbers and how close they are to five and how close they are to ten. If I had nine plus three, you could show them that you take away one here and you move this over and it's also ten plus two. Thanks for watching today's Math Activity Thursday. I hope you had a fun time with your kids and their Wreck and Wrecks. Is that wreck and wreck?